welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to design a pattern like this. Okay. In this, first we have to observe how many rows are here. Okay. So then we observe that we have five rows. Okay. For that, first we have to write a loop which will iterate from one to five. Okay. It simply means that it will iterate from five times. So that I will write like this and in this the output the pattern is in character form so we will take cat right and it's in reverse order like here you can see that a in the last and b last second c in the middle and in the same way so we will take uh, the loop in reverse order it means the higher to lower so we will take i is equal to and minus minus because we are decrementing after each iteration now this loop will iterate 1 to 5 okay from e to a uh, now in every row we have five characters for that we want we have to write a loop which will iterate five times okay within it And what we have to print is E followed by D and then followed by C. For that, if we want to print 5 times E, then this loop will iterate 5 times. But if we print J here, then what will happen? Let's see. It will print E, D, C, B, A, reverse order uh, E, D, C, B, A. But what we want, we want that it print 5 times E. So here we need to observe how this can be done. This can be done with the, this, uh, with the help of this loop. The value of I is what? E. Till the completion of this for loop, the value of I is E. After that, in the second loop, the value of I will be changed to D and the and the execution of till the execution another complete execution of this for loop the value of i will be d in the same way till a so we just need to write here i and now just execute it and here we get e e e then d d d then c c c followed by b then followed by d followed by a sorry uh, but we get the desired output but not in the desired format okay for that what we are missing is a break statement here okay for that we just need to add a break statement here after every com after the completion of this for loop each time for that we just need to write here slash n this will break the line after the completion of this iteration okay just execute it and we get the desired output thanks for watching stay tuned with our channel and please like subscribe and share with your friends thank you